A turn of events today in a case involving a deadly dog attack in Tolland. The life of a dog accused of killing chickens was spared. News A's Aaron Cox tells you why. And there she is, Luna. She is free because of an agreement worked out with the lawyers and the town. Luna, no longer on doggy death row. Holland had ordered the Siberian Husky be put down after she twice escaped invisible fencing, killing neighborhood chickens. Other Husky owners objected, saying the dog was simply acting on instinct. And she went after them much as a cat does a mouse. Richard Rosenthal of the animal rights group The Lexus Project came to court appealing to a judge to spare the dog's life. In the end, reaching an agreement with the town. The defendants shall forth with withdraw its disposal order of Luna and release Luna to the plaintiff. Luna allowed to live, but banished from returning to Tallinn. So she'll be cared for by Double Dog Rescue Group at their facility in Massachusetts. We'll get her home, we'll brush her up and get her some food, and she'll have a run in our huge fenced in yard. Luna had been in solitary confinement at the pound since June, but her fans acknowledged she was well cared for, adding her story should serve as a warning about proper fencing. With any dog, you have to be responsible and do what you can to keep them safe. The rescue group now ready to work with Luna and get her prepared to be placed with a family. Then be a dog again and get a second chance at life. So Luna is off to Massachusetts to start her new life, no longer a Connecticut resident. Reporting on the scene in Tallinn, I'm Erin Cox, News 8.